HSC Mental Health Engagement and Recovery Office, in partnership with Mental Health Ireland, develop and support recovery education structures and systems with regional HSE mental health services. Recovery education takes an adult education-based approach, which focuses on individual strengths. It offers people choices in learning opportunities that support personal recovery and discovery. Recovery education is for people who use mental health services, their families, friends, and supporters. It is for people who work in the mental health services and the wider community. The first word that I think of when I think of recovery education is powerful, meaningful, change, hope, transformative. So recovery education is about helping people who have experienced a traumatic episode in their life, uh, perhaps a period of mental ill health, to recover in an environment that is supportive. So recovery education is based on, on the principles of adult learning. As adults, we tend to learn better when we have a decision in the type of education we're going into. Another aspect of adult learning principles is that transformation piece. So, you know, you come through mental health challenges in life, um, you pick up all sorts, as we all do, you pick up all sorts of messages. Some of those messages are not um, very positive. There's lots of influences in our life growing up family, friends, culture, society. We try to change mindsets and the very fact of being involved in a recovery education. People learn new things about themselves, about the world. In some ways, it's nearly unlearning certain things as well. The benefits that people can get from um, recovery education are legion, depending on where they're coming from. It enables people to expand our consciousness and awareness and knowledge around mental health difficulties, recognizing that the majority of our mental health difficulties are caused by adverse experiences in the past, by trauma, and it doesn't mean that there is something wrong with the person and people can recover from the impact of previous experiences. The voice of the person with lived experience, you bring together the family member and the service provider to sit at the table and to look at, you know, how we can how we can develop recovery oriented education and recovery oriented services. It's powerful to have someone come through an experience and being able to get part of either facilitating recovery education, delivering re recovery education and that empowers others around them because it, it gives a great sense of hope to people as well. So I, I would say the importance of the lived experience is phenomenal and I, and I would see in say, my role as a peer educator not only the power but the impact is on others. I we would say in some of the feedback we get people really kind of can relate to the lived experience stuff and you know we can all have great knowledge around stuff. But I mean, someone that goes through a similar experience to themselves and tell you how they managed it, how they minded themselves, how they struggled, how they got through it. That's the stuff that really connects with people and engages with people. I would hope that the wider community would know all the great work that's happening here um, because there's great stuff happening and I'm forever, you know, signposting to the Recovery College, but I'd like to see it expand beyond the Recovery College and to be just at every, every level of our organisation. I think there's a growing recognition that every person is on a recovery journey. It's not just service users, you know, and that even amongst staff, we all have um, our own story and our, our own learning that we can make. My own personal experience with recovery education has been transformative. I began as a student attending workshops. Um, around 2017, I had a fairly serious mental health crisis and my life came to a standstill. But I guess recovery education was an invitation for me to move forwards again. As I progressed on my recovery journey, I found hope and I saw opportunities. So I began to volunteer within the mental health services and then became a recovery education facilitator. Every day now I see opportunities for recovery to be brought to the fore within the services and within our communities. I guess I have a passion for this kind of work because I've seen the transformational effect it's had on me. I suppose the main thing it's taught me is that recovery is eminently possible. I have seen so many people make so many differences to their mental health and their lives over the last five years um, that it's absolutely inspiring. Recovery education plays a vital role in mental health services, in the promotion of a recovery approach, 
and as a driver of culture change. This is achieved by valuing lived experience as a central component and with continued fidelity to co-production. Staff and students in recovery colleges report having positive and heartwarming experiences. The impact that peer roles can have is reported as being a source of hope and a reminder that recovery is possible for everyone.